Michael, clinical psychologist at Grove Psychology, um, making a video today uh, on the topic of our recent blog, which is about embracing uh, uncomfortability and stress when we go through change. And I thought today was a fairly apt time to be doing that, as I'm currently growing a moustache for Movember, doing some charity work, uh, and this is a pretty uncomfortable position to be in, making a video uh, showing my progression, but here we go anyway. Um, so in our blog, what we talked about is the fact that when we want to go through change, we want to make a, a change in our life uh, for some personal growth, that there's often uh, a high degree of stress uh, and uncertainty that goes through with that. So, you know, we might be going for a job or some other sort of thing that we really want to achieve. And you know, a lot of the times we often give ourselves little outs for that. You know, we talk about how we didn't have enough time, you know, maybe we didn't have enough time to do the application or whatever it might be. Um, don't have enough money, we don't, uh, nobody told us about it, whatever it might be. Um, and they're little justifications, so we get away with it uh, in our own mind. But if we looked at it in more depth, we can acknowledge the fact that that was probably a cop out. And the reason we're doing that is because we're avoiding the uncomfortability, uh, the discomfort that comes from doing uh, something that's quite challenging for us. But the the end goal, the journey of doing that is what's worth it. So uh, the message that's in the blog is that you can't have that personal growth without that degree of uncomfortableness that goes through, through change. So we're looking to embrace that and being okay with that, knowing that the end result is worth it. However, there are a few other things that might be holding us back uh, in terms of core beliefs. So, for example, um, people might have a thought of, I'm not good enough, uh, I always fail, I'm not worthwhile, and that might be holding us back because to try something and to fail and have that core belief exposed is quite difficult and uncomfortable and frightening, so we'd rather avoid it. So that might require some therapy uh, you know, with a psychologist to help you through that. Um, but basically the, the message from the blog is that to have personal growth, to have achievements that you want to get through, you're going to embrace the fact that there's going to be a, a period of time that's quite difficult to go through. It's going to be uncertain, it's going to be stressful, it's going to be uncomfortable. Um, but that the journey is worth it in the end. Okay, So go onto our website, read about it in a bit more detail. Uh, and I hope you've had uh, got something out of this blog.